First of all, mount your phone on a steady tripod. Record yourself. Pretend as if you are pushing out your head with a stick. Then also pretend as if you are bringing back your head. Then after recording yourself, record an empty background. Then save the video to your gallery and head over to CapCut. Right now you are going to make use of your CapCut. So click on your CapCut and open it. Now you open your CapCut and you are inside your CapCut. Now what are you going to do? Click on new project. You know, new project is used for importing a video. It's used for bringing in a particular video that you want to edit. So click on your new project. A new project I've already taken you to your gallery where you have all your videos. So what are you going to do? You are going to select that particular video which you want to edit. So let's say we, click, we select this video. Click on this video and then come down here and click on add. Look at where I'm pointing this arrow. You know, I put this arrow here purposely to make it very easy for you to understand. So if you pay attention to what I'm teaching you here, it is very easy and simple to understand. So kindly pay attention to what I'm teaching you here very well. Now click on add. So when you click on add, you see this video have already added to your project. You understand and what are you going to do you are going to start working on this video right away so in order to start working on this video what are you going to do you're going to come down here and click on edit so i click on edit that's how i want this video to start i want this video to start right here right here where i'm about to raise up this this stick up i'm going to split it here split it here and then delete this first part and then come to the end of this video scroll until you reach the end of this video and then click on this ending part of the video click on the ending part and then come down here and look for freeze so click on freeze and you will notice that the, the ending part of this video is now frozen you understand so what are you going to do you are going to click on the main part of this video this main part of this video and then come down here and look for overlay come and look for overlay click on overlay and you see that this video have already come down as an overlay overlay so click on this uh, background this background of this video the background of this video and then drag it to the end of this video align them together make sure you align them together and then click on this particular video now click on it so you are going to split it here split it right here also come down here where you you pretend as if you are bringing back this your head you understand you pretend as if you are bringing back your head you are going to split it here split it here as well then when you split it, delete every other thing. Delete every other thing. Delete the first part. Every other thing. Delete it out. Delete this one out. So now this is what you are having. You are having something like this. You are having something like this. So what are you going to do? You are going to click on this uh, overlay, this down layer. And then come down here and look for remove BG. Click on remove BG. And then click on custom remover. So you click on custom remover. Click on brush. You understand so now use your your finger your finger and put on your head like this and then start shading it shade only your head shade only your head so when you shade only your head right now you will see that the your body have disappeared and is remaining only your head you understand so what are you going to do you are going to go ahead and click on export look at where i'm pointing this arrow click on export and export this video export it to your gallery now go back to your gallery and bring in that same video that original video which you have not edited yet look at the video here click on it and add it to your project so now you bring in this video at the end of this video click on it and then come down here and look for freeze so look at freeze here click on freeze and when you click on freeze click on the main part of this video click on the main part of this video and come down here and look for overlay click on overlay and this video have already come down as an overlay just like what you did before you are going to still click on the background and then drag the background to the end of this video align them together just like what i'm doing here you're going to do it in this way exactly align them together and when you align them together you are going to click on this uh, main part of the, the video this is uh, a down layer this down overlay and here you're also going to split it here just like what you did before split it and then click on this um middle part the middle part of this video when you click on the middle part what are you going to do you are going to come down here and look for remove bg so click on custom remover and then now what are you going to do use brush and drag it on to 15 just like what you did before put on 15 and then use your two fingers hold on your body now and then shade only your body don't shade the head shade only your body just like this 
shade your body carefully including the stick shade it including the stick shade it including the stick carefully make sure you don't touch your head So guys, right now you can see that your head have removed and you are remaining only with your body. It's remaining. So come down here, right in this place where you split this video here. You understand? You know, when you come to this side, your head will show. And when you come to this, this side, your head will disappear. So right here where your head is disappearing, you are going to come down here and click on overlay. Look at where I'm pointing my arrow. Click on overlay. And the overlay have already taken you to your gallery where you have all your videos. So what are you going to do? You are going to bring in that head. Click on that head that you have recorded that time. Click on it and then come down here and click on add. Shade only the head. Shade only the head like this. So look at your head now. Look at it. Click on this overlay and you will see your head is separate. Look at it. You can put it anywhere. You can take it anywhere. So now you align it together. Put, you are going to apply keyframe here you know this keyframe when i'm pointing this arrow this keyframe is used for the movement of an object you know i've already made a lot of videos on how to use this keyframe so now click on this keyframe and take it inside a little bit and apply another keyframe so apply it drag this head out a little bit and play the video and also apply another keyframe and drag it out a, li a little bit so you will continue you will continue doing this way you apply a keyframe you drag it out and you do it like this until you reach this side you understand something like this so now come to this place where you pretend as if your head was coming to meet your body you understand when you pretend as if your head is coming to meet your body you are going to apply keyframe here apply another keyframe here so we apply keyframe take it inside a little bit and then drag your head and drop it here like this and then when you drop when you drop it here now let's play the video and see the result please guys i'm teaching you all this all these things for free the only favor you can do for me is to subscribe to this channel and like this video please do me a favor by liking this video do me a favor by subscribing to this channel do me a favor by sharing this video i make a lot of videos on how to edit high quality videos like this and i also make a video on how to use CapCut pro for free which the link is in the description of this video you can click on it and watch it check around my channel i have a lot of videos which you can also watch it as well thank you so much for watching see you in my next video